Look what arrived in the mail. <laughs> Hello. You can probably see me from the reflection on the TV, but I'm Ashton. Oh, wait. My phone's covering up my face, sir. That better? <laughs> and yeah. This finally got here. I got it. Bought it from a guy on Twitter named uh, Mr. Toast. Not his real name, but I'm not going to tell you his real name because he probably doesn't want you to know his real name. I don't know. I never asked him. I'm just assuming he doesn't. <laughs> but I am giving you his Twitter name so you can go tell him he's awesome <laughs> if you want to. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. I bought this from him. Paid the paid the price he paid it for. Paid for it plus, you know, 20 bucks for shipping. So, total 60 bucks. And, uh, he got it up to working order. Of course, he didn't have a pa spare PC or cables or anything, so I need to find those. But, uh, that's totally fine. Especially with the PSU, because, I mean, let's be real, the old, like, the old PSUs are, like, notorious for, like, failing at frying the machines. At least is what I know from watching 8-Bit Kai. <laughs> and, uh, Mind Filler Retro and all the other people. In fact, the, like, the main reason I got this was a comment on a Mind Flare Retro video. I was just like, I really want to get into this kind of stuff. And he was like, well, let me help you. And then there was a tweet on his Twitter feed where it's just like hey this guy is trying to get into retro computing let's get him his first commodore 64 i wasn't expecting that but uh <laughs> uh honestly i was just i was just wanting advice like honestly it's, it was on like the uh part one for the uh like c64 build i don't know he probably hasn't released part two yet i don't know i'm gonna have to check after making this video but, um, yeah. I commented on part one saying I really want to get into this, but I need to find, need to find one that isn't like a hundred bucks. And I mean, granted, it's not a hundred bucks, so, but I'm going to have to, well, I spend upwards of a hundred bucks just to get it working. So, you know, there's a trade-off. I have to get AV cables. I know uh, 8-Bit Classics, they sell, the eight, like, the... Now, let's probably rotate this. Give me a second. Alright. Look at the back of this thing. I, just ha I haven't gotten to do that yet. Alright. Where's the cartridge port? This is for the uh, RF. How the frick do I... There we go. This is the RF port. This is the one of these is the monitor port. One of these is the serial port. I can't remember. Let's see. That's uh. It's th okay. So okay. So that's serial. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's an eight pin. That's an 8-pin monitor port, so that one can do, our, like, the LCA or S-Video. Of course, my TV doesn't have S-Video because it's a newer TV. But I'm gonna, you know, get a HDMI converter anyways. This is the cassette port. This is the user port. And then, the, three, the badge is just... It's, like, warped. I knew this thing wasn't in cosmetic condition, but... That's, that's odd. And then, the freaking, like, it's like, like dented and cracked right there. Oh, so this thing doesn't have any screws in it. Unless I don't think. Oh, I should probably show. Oh, yeah, you need to be careful. Because the top is not screwed in. Here we got that power port. I didn't do the cable correctly. Um, the power switch and the two control ports. I actually need. I'm gonna. I'm going to fix that. Give me just a second though. To just very quickly fix that. And. Um, yeah. Oh. Ah. Trying to 
sure things that way, yeah. Okay, so now the... I guess that's for, What is that for? I guess that's for, like, the power LED. And then there's got the other cable that's for the, uh... Keyboard cable that's all the way over here. I can't even get that to come out, so I can't take the top off completely. Although I can probably... It might be actually a good idea to show you all the inside. Give me just a second, though. Because the inside, the interior, is actually in very good condition. You made sure it worked. I still can't get the keyboard cable out. And, uh, yeah, also, I have, uh, my suspicions have been confirmed. That cable is the one for the power LED. I need extra light. There we go. That's just good enough, I think. Actually, you know what? No, I need more. I need more. Let's, let's move it. There we go. Alright. This is probably the best I can do for opening it up. Because this thing, this keyboard cable just won't budge for me. It's either because I have weak arm strength or because it's just a very sturdy connector. And, uh, yeah, this is what the inside looks like. Got a lot of little RAM chips and bus transceivers and... Is there a bus transceiver on here? Uh, I don't know. It's got a Mitsumi. This is like the RF thing. Then this is the cartridge port. And I, what I like about this is that Mr. Toast made his own little sticker. Refurbished and tested January 2020. I freaking love that. I need to get something to work and make stuff like that. And then here's, you know, assembled in Hong Kong. Okay, I don't know what that is. And then over here's where the power, or the power LED connects. And then there's this, like, transceiver or something. I can't remember what that is. It's... Someone knows what those markings are. Please tell me. Someone know. But yeah, it's like screwed into this thing. It's like it has a heat sink. I think it's under here. Somewhere. And then, you know, here's... Here. It's the 6510. This is basically the... Uh, it takes five or two in this machine. Then we got the ROMs, and then over here are the uh, CIAs that are covered up in this freaking keyboard cable that I can't get rid of. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's working well. It's working well. And then there's the power port, there's the switch. Uh, and yeah, I just. Did a good job with the inside, Mr. Toast. It's not like I'm freaking like talking to talking in the freaking matrix. Mr. Anderson. <laughs> Funny. Never even watched the Matrix. I just saw that from clips on YouTube. Alright. Put that down so I can get the top back on. Do 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 there we go. I need to get the. I need to get this thing with the the, the screws. Let's 
Yeah, the that's weird. The three screws are missing. Which I mean it makes sense because they're gonna have to replace the case anyways, but still kind of odd. Then here's the uh, model. Model number, model number 64, serial number PO135818182. Tend to repair by unhealthy persons, voids warranty. Well, I don't think we have to worry about that because this thing, it, the, like the company, not, it doesn't even exist anymore. Kind of sad, but I mean, that's the truth. And I mean, on the bright side, concerning the fact there's a freaking sticker on the, uh, concerning there's a sticker on the on the on the motherboard where the clutch board is. I'm guessing I have a new warranty. <laughs> I am totally kidding. I'm not expecting him to repair this. <laughs> I'm going to handle that myself, assuming I know what I'm doing, which I probably don't. <laughs> uh, yeah. Because now I can just put on my. I just thought about this. I have a charging port right there. Okay, good to know. If I ever put my phone on the uh, charging stand while recording, don't put it where the screen is facing the stand because my switch controller will turn off the recording. I'm going to have to edit that. Oh, boy. But, yeah. Look at this boy. I got it. It's mine. It's mine. I got a... Well, this... What this can be? This be like a freaking thumbnail for YouTube. So you need to be careful because the uh, screws aren't in there. Alright, you're still not, you're still not taking a snapshot? Okay. Do I need to, do I need to like, why is that not working? Why is that not working? Hey, that's weird, but um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something about this, and uh, yeah, peace. Alrighty, okay, now back there while I fix the thing, um, yeah, so, yeah, this is my, this is my count, this is my converse for now. <laughs> I'm kind of happy. Oh, it just fell out, fell out of my pants. I'm gonna have to pick that up, but uh, yeah, and. Probably have it sitting here, and then have my laptop right there, and have the, the screen up there. We're gonna do the other way around. That probably make more sense. Huh. Okay, right now I'm just messing around with the keyboard. You can, you can leave now if you want. I mean, there's probably not much than just me messing with the keyboard now. I mean, if you, you subscribe, if you want to see more of this machine or just any of the other random crap that I do, um, and, uh, yeah, you have an awesome day. I'm just gonna miss with uh this and then clean up the what in the world fell all right there's my wallet i need to get the, the knife my papa's knife and put my camera just pull up there I need to grab that this chair hates being moved ah Okay, now I can go back to mess with the keyboard on the 64. I didn't even, never even thought I'd ever get a hold of. This is arriving a little late because, like the, it estimated they estimated that I would get here like at like Monday, but I ended up running a little bit late. I got the Shreveport yesterday, but uh, I didn't get here and you know, rest until today. <laughs> I love this keyboard. You know, and I can probably do, do a little bit of comparison between 
this keyboard and the keys on my uh, you know razor thing so I have a bunch of razor things so keys on that keys on the 64 yeah, just for, just for fun, which one's better? <laughs> I don't know, tell me tell me in the comments, I don't know. But I mean, then again, this is like, you know, after the video is pretty much pretty much ended, so... You know, I don't know, I mean, if you've gotten this far, you know, just tell me which one sounds better. Or... Kind of depends, huh? And then, just for fun, here's my freaking... that sound and it's trying to make up the, don't make up the switch boy watch out <laughs> but um uh, yeah you uh you have an awesome day if you gotten this far subscribe if you want to see more of this or anything else uh like the video if you like the commodore 64 or me for some reason or the, just the video if you don't like anything hit, hit dislike and give me some constructive criticism because I make it makes sense for me to improve on this. And um, yeah, you have an awesome day. Bye.